Hey YouTubers, it's Nancy's Crafts. Sorry I've been away. I'm going on vacation soon, but I wanted to do a quick tutorial on these Easter flowers. I'm ma mainly doing the purple lavender ones. All you need, let's get started. Glue gun, scissors, maybe like a pencil. Um, I like using the chopstick, it's a little bit uh, thinner, or a paintbrush stick and card stock paper uh stock paper computer paper let's get started so first of all you're going to take i'm going to do it on the white sheet here and you're going to just take the eight by i think they're eight by twelve and to do more flowers at once you can put two more whatever your scissors want to cut so you got the two pieces. You're going to take one. Well, let's take the both. So I'll show you how I cut the work in half. And you also, you're going to crease it. Not even Steven there, but that's okay. And then you're going to start making scissor cuts all the way down. All the way down. And that's what I did here with my red ones, my orange ones my purple so you're going to do it all the way down cut your scissors if you need to get a ruler or a stick and mark a marking for you across with the pen that way you don't cut off your paper and continue but i usually just do it myself like that and as you see I put two times that way I could double my flowers and make them quicker so once you got all that cut there you're going to turn it around and very softly you'll bend it towards the other way and glue it down all the way like that so here's where my glue gun comes in. Glue it all the way across to stay shut. And there you got your beginning of your flower, which is right here. So next you're going to want to get your little square piece. And I just cut square pieces not necessarily any size let's do two at a time you're going to get your scissors and you're going to cut triangles and that's how you get your little leaves on your flower so after you've got your little leaves on your flower then you're going to take your scissors and i just curl them up a little bit back I mean be careful if you do it too hard you'll tear the paper okay so you are to it okay so now we have our paper ready our flower ready our leaves this is where you come in with your stem you need your pin uh, this is the chopstick you're going to cut your paper, your stock paper, in that size, right? This is for your stem. So when you got your piece like that, you're going to lay it down or on your hand, and you're going to start twirling up and twisting it on your stick. Twist, twist, twist it tight, twist it tight. There you go till you get to, to the top. And there I got a little glue gun there. Put it over. Careful. Supervision. Adult. When you're using the glue gun, it gets hot. And now you're going to slip out your stick. So there's my stem. And you need two of them. Because I'll show you why you need two in just a moment. So. We're going to take our flower now. You're going to take your stem, 
put a little glue on it, and that's where we're going to start our flower. Okay, that's my tip of my flower. And go, put more glue gun, and as you turn it, you got to turn it and make sure you're going on the bottom as you twist it. All the way, all the way. Twist it a little bit more to go towards the bottom. More glue gun. Twist, twist. More glue gun. Twist till you're at the very end. There you go. See, so you'll run out of stem, and that's why usually to see how it fits in the other one and you can just twerk, turn it in there. I'm going to put a little bit of glue gun and then I'm going to get the small end and twist it in there. See how I twisted it? I put some glue and there it is. There's my stem and my flower. So here's your leaf. Same thing, just put a little bit of glue gun and start wrapping your little greenery around the bottom. And if it tears, that's okay. You just got to glue it. So there it is, folks. Your Easter flowers. Very simple to do. I was wondering if I could do it with miniature, and yes, miniature size for the Barbie. Hope you like the tutorial, folks. Toodaloo!